Steve, we are the holders of the Nathaniel MG Cup. And I guess we want to retain it again this time around. Uh, yeah, the aim at the start of the season is to win every competition that we're in. Um, obviously, we went out of the um, Iron Brew Cup, um, but we were the holders of um, the Nathaniel Cup. Um, we've won it four times on the trot, nine times in total. We're looking to make it the fifth and the tenth, tenth um, trophy. Um, and it'll be a tough tough competition um, but like I say if we're right we'll go into it full of confidence. This is a busy week for the New Saints as far as games are concerned. Three in the space of six days. How does that affect team selection with the squad I guess being involved right the way through the week? Yeah that, that's why we have a big squad. Um, we're confident in all our players you know um, whoever we put in, we're, we're confident um, in, in their ability, otherwise they wouldn't be here. Um, the squad will be utilised um, and it will be a good chance for players as well to get, get some minutes. Tomorrow is the game, today was the final training session, you took that. Looking on, there seemed to be a good spirit in the camp ahead of this fixture against Landino. Yeah, um, like I say, the lads have come in Monday morning. Um, got the cobwebs off from Saturday. Um, good intensity, um, good training session, and like you say, um, looking forward to putting Saturday right tomorrow. And talking of Saturday, that was a 1 1 draw, of course, at Newtown. Some people could say that was a, a negative, but at the same time, the game tomorrow against Landidno is an opportunity to put that right. Yeah, we were disappointed um, Saturday, um, but it was an opportunity to go further ahead. Um, I don't think we did enough first half. Um, second half we, we did enough, even though we didn't do enough first half, we created chances. Um, they've, they've, created, they've scored the goal, they've had one more chance and that's really all they, they had. Um, we created two or three good chances first half, didn't take them. Um, we scored the goal second half, but created another two or three good chances. Um, on another day, they go in, we win the game comfortably. Um, second half was better, first half weren't so good. Um, but like I said, the lads put it right second half, and we'll look to put it right tomorrow night again. This is our second game against Landed now in the space of a couple of weeks or so. It gives us an opportunity to have a look at them first time round, they are a much changed side this season, of course. Yeah, um, I thought we played really well. Um, when we played them in the league, we, we were at it. Um, we played some really good football. Um, we'll, we'll approach the game in the same manner. Um, I think they'll change a little bit. Um, they'll get closer to us, um, they'll be more physical. You know, um, but, like I say, We'll approach it in the same manner as we did the league game, as we do every game, and we'll look there, look there, not to go there to get the win and to get into the next round. And as you said, Steve, they'll probably approach the game slightly differently. I guess you have to look at the opponent as a coach, but the main consideration is the new Saints and our approach to the game. Yeah, me and Scotty always do our own work on the opposition. Um, we plan, prepare, and you know. The lads go out, we deliver it to the lads and they go out and um, play, play the game um, to the game plan and nine times out of ten it usually works. Um, like I say, we'll, we're looking to bounce back to winning ways after Saturday and it's great to have a game so close to bounce back. And back to our opponents, they've made some very good signings this season for them they're at the wrong end of the JD Welsh Premier League table and most people would say that sooner or later they will kickstart their season and I guess for us when we travel there tomorrow it's to make sure they don't kickstart it against us. Yeah, yeah, obviously, um, like I said, they're, they're, they're having a tough time at the moment but a wounded animal is a dangerous animal um, and we know that, that's why we'll go there in the right frame of mind. Um, hopefully get the win. And finally Steve, 
we've already referred to the squad and the use of the squad in busy times like this. What's the injury situation like at the present time here at Park Hall? It's all right. Um, we've got one or two with um, just slight knocks, um, which we're waiting to heal. Um, but we're, we're all right. We're not too bad. 